Welcome to Dartmoor! And it's been a little while since I've been down this far and I am near Tavistock. Uh, just up over the hill, obviously you can't see it right now, is the Tavi 7. And I really can't wait. It's been a long time since I've done this event. So let's get on over there. But first, let's get changed. But did you know people here I don't know if you can see them but everyone's walking to the HQ I'm run walking not got my vest on yet that's in my bag I'm gonna go get my number I got my shorts on and what a lovely a day it is for it uh, yesterday it was hammering down with rain so I'm kind of surprised number of people and I have my family here to support me say hello dad morning <laughs> hello mommy hello. hello angel hi this is my youngest sister how old are you 11 do you like running kind of kind of do you do any sports not really you can kind of guess by the pause not a sporty but doesn't matter she has her own hobbies hi James he has taken many of my pictures over the years and just quickly come over to say hello and he takes pictures for Tavi oh, what's it Tavi Gazette Tavi Times oh, it was one of those I can't think of what their name's called now Times Gazette there we go that's it folks 700 set off on this year's Tavi 7 multi clubs great support here 700 running it's an amazing sight from where we are stood watching you set off. Team Championship. We're going to start off with a reward for that. 
trophy here was the man's shield, donated in uh, 19... <laughs> Thank you, Dave. 1920, so 100 years old next year. Uh, and you can see all the winners on that. So <coughs> men were racing for that. This was the ladies' trophy. It wasn't introduced until 1994 by Tibbet and Harry as they pressed for a ladies' trophy. So we reinvigorated it with a new shield to match the men's shield. So this will be going for another 100 years now as well. So there we are. Um, in the men's trophy, you needed six to score. And in the ladies' trophy, you needed three to score. So um, we've got Devon Road Race uh, team secretary here. So Dave Phillips, he's going to uh, announce the winner. Yeah. Um, in third place um, were Tiverton Running Project, Rachel Malthouse, Hayley Clark Tavistock. and Tavistock. Hannah Walton. Tavistock, I beg your pardon. In second place, South West Roadrunners, Amy Jones, Rosie Glazier, Susie Toff. <laughs> And the win winners of the newly revamped, and thank you very much to Tavistock AC for, for getting a new piece of wood, a very splendid it is too. Winners, Tavistock, Jody Fisk, Sam Lake, and Tilly McDowell. and get it right this year and there is a bit of a question mark about the team that had the first six runners home about whether they are actually affiliated i know that they intend to be affiliated but i've got to take uh, this question back to the devon county aa i don't want to make the decision on my own i can tell you that south Moulton had the first six runners home but the question is were they affiliated or not and Tavistock had the next six, and Tiverton, t I keep saying Tiverton, I live in Tiverton, Tavistock Running Project um, had the next six, followed by South West Roadrunners. So the question is, um, an administrative thing, are South Moulton the, should they get their names on there, or should it be Tavistock? So I'm going to take that back to the committee, I'm not going to make the decision myself, I'm sorry about that, very unsatisfactory, but there we are, we must get it right. And then we'll find, once we establish who is the winning team, we are uh, presented at a suitably uh, prestigious occasion. So, thank you, thank and you. thank you, Kate. Thank you. We are all winners now, so as a male winner, in a time of 36.23, which is a new course record, was Philip Wiley from Cheltenham and Tony Harris. <laughs> Philip wins a trophy for the course record and 50 pounds and 50 pounds and a trophy for uh, first overall. And then second for the time of 39.29 was Adam Holland. That brings this wonderful event to the end. Got the presentation, I got 30 pound, and my nice trophy, that money will go straight into my car for my travel all the way back down here, but it was worth it. It was hard work, I really struggled against that wind, and I was in fourth place at one point, and somehow managed to work my way back up to second. Uh, the bloke who won it actually set a new course record, which was absolutely awesome, and I think he was about three minutes ahead of me. Smashed it, absolutely smashed it. And the ladies, she was only five seconds outside the course record, but maybe she'll get it next year. Thanks for tuning in. Another day, another run. Bye!